Hi, I'm Brian. I will introduce our new product A31T216 in this video. We will explain to you the main feature of A31T216, especially the touch library and demonstrate demo set together. Above semiconductor provide touch library for user convenience. The technical document of A31T216 can be downloaded from the above website. Now, let me explain the Touch Library API. First, set touch parameters of the set library function in the main C file. Set to use the shield function in applications where there is a risk of exposure to moisture. Set the number of touch sensing counts to be accumulated and read for sensitivity adjustment. Set the threshold value of the channel differently according to the sensitivity of the channel. The baseline tracking method is defined according to the difference between baseline and touch data. Define how low the threshold should be set to compensate for touch release caused by noise. In order to recover the data reverse phenomenon between touch data and baseline, when power is supplied while touching, the reversal phenomenon is defined through the following two parameters. It is used to prevent touch detection and release malfunction due to momentary noise. Set the strength of IIR filter. By setting the time for power to reach the normal level, abnormal touch data acquisition is avoided. When using one port in common for touch and LED control, we can define touch operation time and LED operation time. UART communication baud rate with GUI can be set. We will demonstrate the demo set now. First, press the power button on the left side of the panel. Then, the menu and numbers are displayed with buzzer sound. If we press the power button on a washing machine, the washing machine operation menu is active. If the power button on dryer is pressed, the dryer operation menu is active. Whenever each key is pressed, the key value is displayed in digit segment with buzzer sound. Let's spray water on the demo set to see the water shield function. Run the touch sense GUI. Move the cursor to the upper left corner on the screen. And select UART. And then select COMPORT. Select the baud rate equal 115.2K and then click Start. In the UART Set menu, check Data1 and Data2, enter Start value as a 0, number as a 6, and click Get. Next, select the checkbox as a pair on the left as shown on the screen, and then click the Clear button. Data1 is low data, and Data2 is base data. Start 0 and number 6 means that the data is from 6th channel of which CH index number start from 0. We can see the changes in the touch data for the corresponding key on the touch sense GUI screen. Now, let me explain the configuration of circuit. 11 channels from CS0 to CS10 are used for touch channels. To control the 48 LEDs, a total of 8 COM and SEC ports are used. To control the 15 high eminence LED, a total number of 10 GPIO are used. To control the buzzer, the single channel of PWM and GPIO are used. For the joke shuttle dial input, 2 GPIO are used.
The A31 T214 and T16 is high performed 32 bit microcontroller based on ARM Core Texandra Plus CPU, specialized for applications that use touch and LCD and LED display at the same time. It consists of 128 till 256 kilobytes flash memory, 16 kilobytes SRAM, self-capacitive 24 touch, LCD driver, LED driver, and support various interface functions such as USART, UART, SPI, and I2C. This video will be explained with A31 T216 and the contents of this description are the same as A31 T214. Let me explain the T-type LED of A31 T216. The T-type LED of A31 T216 is configured to share ports with COM and SAG, so we can control the LEDs with a small number of IOs. As shown on the screen, when 56 LEDs are used, the M-type method required 15 IOs while the T-type method required only 8 IOs. The LED driving method of T-type and M-type are described on screen. Touch IP of A31 T216 include a logic of CS noise avoidance function. On the screen, we can check the difference between LED operation with CS noise avoidance function and LED operation without CS noise avoidance function. A31 T216 can be functioned as a shield for water tolerance. It prevents touch malfunction due to unwanted moisture. Water tolerance can be divided into two functions as I described below. We can check the change in the touch data caused by water droplet. As we can see on the screen, when using CH shield, there is a little change in touch data caused by water droplets. Even in an environment with the water around touchpad, we can check the normal touch function. So far, we have briefly looked into the new product A31 T216. For more information, please refer the QR code and achieve your dream with above semiconductor.